Are you someone who struggles with an irregular period? Are you constantly wondering if today is going to be the day that it finally shows up? Well, if you are, then today in this video, I'm going to be talking about three key foods that you're going to want to incorporate into your diet so that you can be on your way to having a regular pain-free period. So stay tuned. So welcome to episode number two of Jennifer Bagel TV. I'm Jennifer Bagel and I help women with PCOS and endometriosis to reverse your symptoms, take back your power and live life on your terms. Now if you're new here, consider subscribing because each and every week I share tips and tricks with you to help you heal. Today we're talking all about irregular periods and specifically we're talking about three key foods that you can bring in that can get you on your way to having a regular pain-free period. The first food that I want to tell you about is tomatoes. Now tomatoes are key for healing the reproductive system and in particular they are rock stars in supporting the body to actually get rid of cysts which is very important for women with PCOS which is polycystic ovarian syndrome or anyone who suffers from an irregular cycle. Now I don't want you getting caught up in the misinformation that's out there about nightshades in thinking that tomatoes are detrimental to your health because the truth is that tomatoes are powerful healers and they can stop um, cancer cells from multiplying and spreading. They protect the body from toxins and pathogens that can wreak havoc on the reproductive system, causing things like irregular periods. It's misinformation like this that prevented me from having a regular cycle for years, for most of my life. And it's also what contributed to me taking five years to find the right information to finally regulate my cycle. Now, I don't want you waiting another minute, never mind five years, to get your hands on the right information. So do yourself a favor and bring tomatoes into your life. The second food I want to tell you about is lettuces. Now lettuces are powerful cleansers that expel toxins from the lymphatic system. And what this does is it supports the detoxification pathways to stay open so that toxins and pathogens can be cleansed from the reproductive system. And when that happens, we can start to have a regular cycle. Now on top of that, Lettuces also contain mineral salts, which are very nourishing to every cell and organ in our body, in particular the reproductive system. So it helps provide the building blocks and tools that the reproductive system needs to be able to build itself back up and heal. And lastly, lettuces are very easily digested and assimilated, which means that it's very easy on our system to be able to process and absorb all those nutrients that we need. So again, I encourage you to bring lettuces into your life if you haven't already. On that note, I have a beautiful free resource that I want to share with you all today, and that is my period regulating salad recipe. This salad is simple but effective because it contains concentrated amounts of foods that are specifically targeted to regulating your cycle. And it also happens to be the exact recipe and salad that I used and consumed every single day when I was on my healing journey regulating my cycle. So I can't wait for you to get your hands on it. If you're on my blog already, the link is right below this video. And if you're not, then head over to jenniferbago.com under my blog episode number two and you will find the free download so make sure you hop over there and grab it. Last but certainly not least I want to talk to you today about apples. Now apples are almost considered mundane aren't they? They're a fruit that's available all the time and because of that we often dismiss the incredible healing powers that they hold. The reasons that apples are important for the reproductive system is that they are powerful anti-inflammatories. They contain phytochemicals that actually remove toxic heavy metals and other toxins from the reproductive system and they contain glucose, that much needed glucose that our bodies and reproductive systems need to be able to heal and thrive. So don't dismiss the everyday apple and there really is something to the saying that an apple a day keeps the doctor away. Like I mentioned before, I have a beautiful recipe that ties all of these things together that's available on my blog. So if you're already on my blog, make sure you take advantage of this free resource and click the link below. If you're not, then head over to jenniferbago.com on my blog page. Under episode number two, you will find the download for this beautiful recipe. I hope you found this information helpful and if you did, click the share button and share this with other women and girlfriends that you might know that are struggling with an irregular cycle because the more women that we can get out of pain and suffering, the better. 
Thank you so much for joining me on this episode and I'll see you on the next video.